This is Tim. And this is Joe. They write books and publish books by other people. This is best-selling author and rocket scientist Mark Lawrence. He writes books and does science. Tim and Joe blame Mark for coming up with a fabulous new card game called Horsemen of the Apocalypse. Here's how the game works. You take turns drawing from the deck of cards. When the Horsemen of the Apocalypse turn up, they kill everyone. Unless, that is, the players have innocence they're prepared to sacrifice to ward off their inevitable demise. You can throw anyone and anything under the hooves of the Horsemen. Shown here, death is first to the party, and the players have lined up their defenses against him. Player one has thrown down a cute puppy, a celebrity chef, a flower child, and a pest control van. In addition, there are effect cards to variously deflect attacks towards other players or steal their cards or generally make their day that little bit worse in a whole variety of ways. There's no winning this game, but you can be the last to die. If you're going to be the last person standing, you're sitting as the case may be, you're going to need that rare combination of skill, strategy, and vicious deviosity that your enemies call luck. Each card has four numbers to indicate how much it will slow down each horseman. To slow down famine, you have to be good at producing food, or being food. To slow pestilence, you need to be good at resisting sickness or curing sickness, and so it goes. A flower child is great at slowing down war. She's full of life, so death will take a while to ride her down. But the stereotypical 60s hippie wasn't so hot on personal hygiene, so pestilence could ride through a hippie commune in no time. And being skinny with the munchies won't help you put up a defense against famine. The game is fun to play, easy to learn, and even comes with a family-friendly edition. And yet, it has the depth and nuance to make it something you'll want to play again and again and again. In the end, though, death comes for us all. Unless pestilence, famine, or war get there first. So, if you're the type of person who likes sacrificing others to save your own skin, or just likes fun card games featuring death, puppies, pestilence, famine, flower children, celebrity chefs, war, and stealing, then back our Kickstarter and we'll send you four horsemen in a box.